Greetings, Virgo. Welcome to your horoscope. So, on Sunday, the moon will be in Virgo. And so, and the sun now in Leo, it's like, well, that's in your 12th house. That's a house of isolation. And sometimes it can be the house of, of your own undoing. Now, I have a Virgo friend that she's very curious and she's very meddling about what other people do. And, you know, my I've asked her personally not to do this. My co-worker and superior to me who helps me co-manage the thing is, you know, told her as well. And so it's like, it's difficult, you know, Sometimes when you do a small favor for someone, it's an insult. It's like you either give me a big favor or I want no favor at all. <clears throat> I do not suggest that you operate like that, Virgo. That is not a good way to do things. Never live a, look a gift horse in the mouth. Be, um, be blessed and grateful for what you have right now. And this is a time to go out in the wilderness. This is a time to isolate yourself. This is a time... To really experience nature and um, you are the sign that loves wilderness and I just think of the 12th house this is an incubator of your spiritual life let's do some reflecting let's think about what's happened let's pay attention to our dreams the message that they contained and uh, journal with them and plan on doing things better this coming year just come in the new year then full of life through meditation and isolation